So here's an alligator heart. The deoxygenated blood is coming from the sinus spinosus, and it's flowing into the right atrium. From the right atrium, the deoxygenated blood is going into the right ventricle, and from the right ventricle, it's going to the lungs through this connection, which is the pulmonary artery. This is sending deoxygenated blood to the lungs when the alligator is breathing. Okay, so after that it goes to the lungs, it's going to return to the pulmonary vein. From the pulmonary vein, it's going to go to the left atrium into the left ventricle, and it's going to leave out the left ventricle through this connection here, and it's going to go into the right systemic, the carotid, and the left systemic when the alligator is breathing. Okay, so when the alligator is not breathing, there's going to be the formant of maxillae, which is going to be shut down, closed. So as the alligator is diving, the lungs are going to collapse, and there's going to be less and less uh, usage of the pulmonary artery. Therefore, instead of the deoxygenated blood going to the pulmonary artery like normal, it's going to go out to the systemic artery right here. And that's going to circulate to the rest of the body. And uh, these three, the two carotid and the less systemic, is going to also be sending deoxygenated blood to the rest of the body. So this form of maxillae, or pen penise, form of penise is going to be closed. And um, that's pretty much it. Right? Okay.